Brad Pass Reactions. Today we got Lil Kai from Jerome True Tales of a Corn. Maybe this one's produced by my brother Nas T, and I don't know, but I'm locked in with Nas T. I'm trying to get locked in with Lil Kai, you know, to do reactions or maybe an interview or something. So hit my DM or whoever your manager is, have them hit my DM. You know how that go, bro. Let's get it. Let's get this Two Tales of a Coin. Oh, I thought there was no sound. Yeah, bro. Okay, I'm already Without this rap shit, I'll be outside clapping gas with traps again. He said, without this rap shit, I'll be outside shooting clapping gas. All right, for any of y'all that don't know what gat is a gun, all right? That's the, in Philly, they call the gat a gun, all right? And also, clapping gas means like shooting gas. Shooting guns, basically. And also, um, all right, so boom. This, so basically it's saying a rap, like, saved him, like, from, from whatever, you know, like, from, because a lot of kids, young kids in inner cities, when they grow up, right, though, they get, like, they put, like, some people don't, they put guns there, bro, literally, and then, they just, have, you know, you know what I mean? Like, they have guns and shit. I don't really want to speak on it because, number one, I'm not from, I'm from the county, so I'm not really, I'm just a fan of the music. I, I love, not, I love Kai from Jerome. I love Nas T, my guy. So, um, you know, I'm just a fan of the music and the art, the art. So I don't really want to speak on that because I don't know what he's into. I don't know what any of y'all are into. Stuck around the talking snake saying I got your back again. If they hit you once, they just gonna wait for you to lag again. They hit me, we hit them back to back to back to back again. The same shit that made me sad then gonna make me laugh if I win. Said I couldn't live without back then, I got it back again. And when I got it back, I didn't need it, I was snapping in. I ain't no confidence in me, that's what was slacking in. All the niggas fucking with them niggas trying to come back around. But they can't even come back around down there knowing I'm back in town. Wanna show gratitude to them as well, they show little cock clan. I showed them a real nigga. I showed them a real bull of the shit that I'm trying to mimic now. No bullshit, bro. Bro, you hot this hot, bro. I showed I showed a lot of people love, bro. And I just got worried that one of my homies is cool with me that I thought wasn't. But we cool and shit. We good. Like everything's good. Everything good. Everything Gucci and shit. But like a lot of people, bro. And it's like fuck them, bro. Just really fuck them. Because some people will, will, like, hate on you. And, like, just some people, not all people. But some bulls will just not fuck with you because you're doing better than them. Even even at regular jobs, bro. Like, you're at a regular job and you get a promotion, someone could hate you. Or if you're an artist, you got a lot of hate from your, from your city or because you're doing better than well, them. Like, some people could be standing on the block where they sound dope, right? In GTA, by the way. Um, but if you're not doing that, you're not considered lame and shit like that. But Lil Kai had one of the hottest out of Philly. I fuck with him. I said that about a lot of artists, but Lil Kai hard. Yo, that's his daughter. That's what's up. That's what's up. He put his daughter in there. That's what's up. Be thankful for the hardships that made me. Same ship that tried to save me. Let it bend, but it ain't break me. I'm dancing and crazy like I don't believe in God or some. I was hard hit. Should've listened to my mama, son. She just wanna hold me close. She almost lost my mama, son. Think I took all of her heart because I got a lot of son. If you ain't down the door, you shouldn't be in the streets no more. I've been in the chicken. I ain't really in the beef no more. I've been trying to do some shit that niggas never seen before. I've been yeah. trying to ball. Yo, Nas T, yo, Brody, you went crazy with this beat, bro. You went crazy with this beat. And he's coming, how, how Kai from Drum come on every beat, bro. He go crazy on every beat. Go crazy, bro. But you mean, like, I fuck with him. What did I just do? They gonna treat me like I wasn't me before. They gonna treat me Where's like I wasn't me before. I wasn't me. Oh, no, okay. Oh, so it went black. The screen went black. I thought the video was over. Nah, it's not, bro. Hold on. Don't oh, treat me like I want, yo, you switched the beat up? That's crazy. Let's see how I got to talk this shit. 
I was in the trap, my mama thinking I am at granny house. Wasn't that far off because I had them drugs in granny house. I wanted my own shit, I ain't one, be at granny house. Hustle hard, always had more work before I ran it out. They was grabbing clothes, I grabbed more work, I was standing out. I'm 16, but had shootouts for weeks, I bought my cannon out. Damn, Hold up. Hold up, bro. You 16? Or you were 16? Because you don't look 16, brody. You look like you're like 27 or some shit. I'm not being mean, bro. I'm just saying. You look older, but you, you say I was 16 or what's up? You gotta let me know in the DM, bro. Put me in the hood, pulling the camera out. Know some niggas love me there, but some niggas wanna fan me out. Back and forth, OT, the ops can't even get a son of me. So they mad, they can't tell you no stories how they spent on me, so they spent on me. Niggas act like they deserve a cent from me. I was hurting, niggas wasn't trying to spend a cent on me. I've been working, I'm creating assets and cash flows. Do something new. I've been working, I've been creating assets and cash I'm trying to do that too, bro. It's hard, bro. Real rap, especially when, like, it seemed like I got money because of my backdrop and everything. And, like, you know, my parents. And, yeah, they, they did they do some things for me so I won't ha so I won't have to struggle and shit. And that's the end goal for everybody to get out to struggle. Shout out my man's OTS, OTS Kaz, OTS uh, Zantana, all that bulls. But, you know, um, yeah, bro. The end goal is just to make it out. Make it out of wherever you're. You're like, like if you in poverty, you gonna make that shit out. You make gonna make it out, bro. And you could do that by real estate, like not just rapping, bro. Like you can rap, it can be your like getting in the door, right? Get you in the door, get your foot in the door. Then once you do that, boom, you start a side hustle with the with the rap with the rap money and shit. And you uh just put out perform at shows, get. Brand sponsorships, shit like that. But through Instagram, there's like millions of ways to get money now. Legally, I'm not saying I'm not. If you want to go the other route, I'm not gonna say nothing, but I would advise against that. But that's not. I'm not. I'm not no op or no cop or none of that. I'm just a YouTuber suggesting some shit, bro. I I mean, I'm not even a street dude either. So like, I'm just. I just love. Like I said earlier, I love the music. I respect the hustle. I respect your craft. And you know what I mean? It's lit. I'll try for a week, but then I'm back home. I'm connecting dots like every day I get my trap on. I ain't selling drugs, I'm doing other things to pass on. I'm trying Yeah, that's crazy. That's what I just said. What did I just that's crazy. I just said that, bro. He don't do that. Like uh, he I mean, I'm not gonna say that now. Um you can like I said, like you can do things other things to get assets. There's millions, like you can literally make money off Instagram now. Like I just gotta I just gotta pop up the other day. I'm so proud of myself. Um, I got a pop up on my Instagram and it said, You are now eligible to make money off gifts. Gifts. G I F T S. I keep saying because I'm saying gifts. And I was like, What the fuck? Like I work so hard for that. You can make money off Instagram, people can you can make money off features if you're an artist. You can make money off art if you're a, if you're an actual like paint and shit. There's so much you can do that you don't gotta like with the especially with the phone, bro. Like content. A lot of people need content, bro. I'm I'm on my wallow shit today. No bullshit. Trying get on. I have to worry about getting back on. Seen too many fall off. I try to find something to latch on. You ain't never ever gotta ask me if my strap on. You ain't never ever gotta ask me if my strap on. I represent the street niggas. The ones who understand the plans was always beat the streets, nigga. I get filmed in the streets, nigga. Or get filmed guilty by no bullshit ass beef, nigga. But we still try to sleep, niggas. We going for the sweet, nigga. I done made some changes now. Try to find somewhere to be, nigga. Somewhere to find some peace. Said not carrying a piece, niggas. I'm more successful than the world. Bro, you're gonna you're gonna blow up. I'm telling you right now, you're gonna fucking blow up. If you haven't already, you're gonna blow up. Like I see your Instagram, you only have 13,000 followers. You're gonna shoot up there. Just keep going. Keep applying that pressure, bro. I like the topic, John. I like, and that was also produced by my brother Nas T. Shout out to you, Brody. Um and some other people. I don't know who your names are. I forget. And I forget. This was produced, I think, by two people. But I forget who they were, bro. Ones that used to teach used niggas. To teach and niggas. I respect the game for real. That's, that's why, why I teach, teach niggas. Yeah. If I can, I'm going to show love because that's cheap, nigga. Yeah. Right, niggas yo, real rap, bro. Show love. I show love to everybody, especially Philly because I'm from the county. I'm from a county outside of Philly. 
Delaware. I'm from Delaware. You probably know where it is, fucking Delaware County, bro. I'm from Delaware County. Um, and uh, I just love Philly hip hop. Like I grew up on Meek. Um, let me see who else. What else, bro? Just you know, I grew up on all that shit. So that's what's up. Passing out them sluts like they free, nigga. I was falling down the path that shit was steep. I was falling down the path that shit was steep, nigga. I lost homies to some shit that weren't deep, nigga. Some shit don't make no sense, but nothing makes sense in the streets, nigga. I lost homies to some shit that weren't deep, nigga. Some shit that make no sense, but nothing makes sense in the streets, nigga. I was in the trap, my mom thinking I'm at Granny House. Wasn't that far off because I had them drugs in Granny House. I wanted my own shit, I ain't wanna be at Granny House. Hustle hard, always had more work before I ran it out. They was grabbing clothes, I grabbed more work, I am was standing out. I'm 16. Bro, again, here we go with the I'm 16, bro. You do not look 16, bro. You go literally walk into the store where I work at and straight up get shit. Because you look like you're like 27, 28, bro. I'm not even being mean, bro. I'm not being mean. I'm just saying, like, I don't know your age. You 16, bro. You grown as hell, bro. I'm not being mean either. Like, I, I'm only 25. I probably look like I'm like 30 or some shit. I don't fucking know, bro. But, um, yeah. Again, if you did, if you're not saying that, let me know in the DM, bro. Anyway, that was my reaction to Lil Kai from Jerome, uh, Two Tales of a Coin. So tap in with my brother, uh, tap in with my brother Lil Kai. Fuck with him. Fuck with uh me on Instagram, a money six one zero. Twitter, a money six one zero, and Snapchat, a money underscore six one zero. Right past reactions, we out. Peace.